Hello everyone, thanks for tuning into the video. Um, just wanted to say a big thank you to uh, all the new subscribers that are coming on. Uh, I have uh, advertised that I'm going to be doing a uh, building your RPG from scratch video soon. Um, I will be starting that shortly. I was supposed to start it once I got back from my work trip, but um, yeah, it's been a little bit busy over here. I uh, have finally gotten into setting it all up, so I'm going to be bringing out a video in the next few days, which will be a bit of a prologue or a little bit of a setup video about how to put things in. Um, just for this video, though, I'm just going to show you how to install the Quest add-on, which is one of the main add-ons that we're going to be using for that uh, yeah, for the RPG. Um, doesn't require too much to set up to get working, uh, but it does require that you uh, put in a little bit of editing, and not a lot of people know how to edit the item enums. So anyway, the first thing we want to do is going to come down here, we're going to import the custom package, which is Evelay's RPG uh, pack for Invector. Now, the, whatever version you've got, um, I think the current one's beta 7, uh, should be the latest one. So just click that, we're just going to click open. As you can see, uh, we want to put in everything we've got, even the demo scenes, because uh, that'll help us go through with um, figuring out how to do it. Now let's just have a look, everything's there, so we're just going to click on import, and just going to give it a few minutes for it to load up. Alright, so it's in. So now you'll see that uh, as soon as we've put it in, uh, see so I'm going to have a, a lot of these little ones, I'm just going to hide those. So we've got a lot of these errors that pop up here. Um, don't be alarmed, that's actually supposed to happen. When it first happened for me, I was a little bit alarmed. Um, however, if you come down to uh, quest manager and you see here we've got the PDF document, I'm just going to open that up. Uh, now we come in here to getting started. Sorry, I might just make that full screen so you can probably read it better. Um, so installing add-on, um, you'll see many compiler errors, not to worry, uh, a few missing attributes that we need to do. So it says that we need to go into the items enum list and we need to add these two items to that list. So I'll show you exactly how to do that. And if we jump along here, now you go to the Invector in the top menu, Go down to uh, Inventory, come along here to Item Enums, open Item Enums Editor. So when we brought up, this will bring up this window. Now we look for uh, Item Enums List, which is this one here in the middle. And we've got four attributes on there. Now what we need to do to add those uh, new attributes in, we've got to change that to six. And then you can just hit Tab or even Enter, I think works. Come down here to number four. Uh, and then we need to type in Buy Price From Vendor. And we need to go sell. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Price to vendor. Okay, so as you can see here, we've put in the buy price and the sell price. Now it's um, important that you put them in as they are written here. You'll notice that each of the words are capitalised. I have tried putting them in with lowercase, and it's still coming up with the errors. Um, so you need to capitalise those letters, and it's definitely buy price from vendor and sell price to vendor. So once you put in those two. Um, you can go down to this bottom here where it says, ref uh, sorry, refresh item enums. Ooh, you alright buddy? Click on refresh. Sorry, my okay. kid's just falling down in the background, that's fine. And then close it up here, and as you can see now, those errors have all cleared. So now we can actually come down to quest manager, we can go to the demo scenes, uh, melee, open it up. So we want this one here, combat demo scene 1. Open that up and now it should all work uh, as intended. Of course, got to wait for it to open up and then play it. I think with my computer here, it takes a little while to actually start. No, oh, well, there you go. You know, I'm going to pause that, I'll put it on maximise so you can see the whole thing. Nice little camera pan there. So now we run off, we can see we've got this gentleman. Once we get close enough, we can hit E. I don't know why the uh, pop up wasn't popping up, but that'll happen. Um, so we can accept that, and we'll accept that one as well. So now you can see, yep, kill the enemies, bring their cards. Play a little with the UI there. Uh, you can see we can buy potions, but we don't really have any money to buy potions. So we'll run through. Ooh. Oh, that's Sun Kick. <laughs> so that's come up here. And now an enemy should spawn once we're over here. Oh, there he is. So we're going to zoom in on him. Oh, no, we've lost him. There we go, he's back. So obviously the zoning works so that you can set up a spawn and they'll despawn when they come out. Nice. So we've dealt him a blow. And now we've got a nice little sword too, so that'll be a bit of fun. And you can see that we've also picked up a key card as part of the quest. Now I'm not going to go through all of this because uh, it's just me playing. I'm having a little bit too much fun now. Weird. <laughs> okay, the kick, the kick obviously... Uh, 
throws it right out of place. Now, yeah, there's a bit of a glitch that's happening at the moment. I'm not sure how to fix it, but once you've killed an enemy, it'll take you out of tab and then all of a sudden slow your character down. Um, I don't know, I'll deal with that one. Uh, I'll ask about that and we'll deal with that later in the next video. Anyway, that's how to install the quest add-on. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next few days. Hopefully I can get started on the uh, RPG tutorial. Thanks for watching.